Welcome to Grey Garden, darling. This is the Commonwealth's first and only hydroponics facility run entirely by robots. There's not even one person here? That's right, darling. We are entirely self-sufficient, with no need for human guidance. You s-
That's it. Right there. Vault 81 security. I don't know where you got your hands on a working pit boy, but you better start talking. I got it in Vault 111. Vault 111? Haven't heard of that one yet. And what sort of business are you looking to take care of here in 81? What's with the third degree? It's called protocol. Think we just let anyone in here? Think again. Who is it, Edwards? Ma'am, some new Commonwealth traveler. Not one of our usual traders. Well, if someone wants in, they can earn it like everyone else. Let me speak to them. Sorry about that. Officer Edwards here was just doing his job. I'm sure you can understand our need for caution. For newcomers, we like to operate on exchange. You help us, we help you. 
But I'm a fellow vault dweller. Can't you just let me in? All the more reason to help out a fellow vault then. Depends. I need more details. Fair enough. Fusion cores. Three, to be exact. You get the fusion cores, we grant the access. Eh, sounds easy. Three fusion cores coming up. Good. You can contact Officer Edwards through the intercom when you're done. Good luck. Rubbish where you found it. be able to pick this.
like a little dust up to get the oil.
That sound, what is it? Getting hungry. Someone there. What do you mean you can't open the gate? Stop playing around, Danny. I'm standing out in the open here for crying out loud. I got orders not to let you in, Miss Piper. I'm sorry. I'm just doing my job. Ooh, just doing your job. Protecting Diamond City means keeping me out, is that it? <laughs> oh, look, it's the scary reporter. Boom. I'm sorry. 
But Mayor McDonough's really steamed, Piper. Saying that article you wrote was all lies. The whole city's in a tizzy. You open this gate right now, Danny Sullivan. I live here. You can't just lock me out. I can wait all day, Danny. Open up. You. You want into Diamond City, right? What? Who are you? Shh. Play along. What? What's that? You said you're a trader up from Quincy? You have enough supplies to keep the general store stocked for a whole month? <laughs> you hear that, Danny? You gonna open the gate and let us in, or are you gonna be the one talking to crazy Myrna about losing out on all the supply? Jeez, all right. I need to make it personal, Piper. Give me a minute. Better head inside quick before old Danny catches on to the bluff. I don't take orders from you. Whoa, take it okay. easy, yikes. You, uh, come along whenever you're ready. What was that? Getting a bad feeling here. Come on, who's there? Just run, right?
through this stay calm Hi. I buy and sell. Just put up everything you got and let's see if we can make a deal. I've got a few minutes to browse. Okay, now I actually have my mic plugged in. <laughs> like, why are they just all over here shooting like this? Just why? Like, day, like, like, they're all just up against the water purifier for no reason whatsoever. Hey. Sir. Okay, so yeah, you're... Who the fuck are you? Where the fuck are you? Like, what the fuck is happening? Find information about Sean. Yeah, I have to get them from Diamond City. Let's hope the whole... Let's just hope that Diamond City itself is not this glitched. What is it? It is... Well... 
Fuck. Okay, everything inside here is fine. Find more of a gem than a dusty home base. Civilization in the rough. It's fine in here, but Piper is going to be stuck outside, and Nash is going to be stuck standing there. Anyone is one of those things. It's that okay. secretary. Okay, and now I have her and her. this John Marston. I think it's John Marston. John Marston pistol. Hair. This thing is actually incredibly good. And I think I'm actually going to add it to my pistol side. So, favorites. And add it there. It, I don't have much ammo for it. But when this... When it gets really powerful... It's going to be incredibly worth it. I'm remembering. Oh shit, I'm not completely Sorry, locked out of Piper. Does anyone fight that? What? I am not completely locked out of her. Told you your luck wouldn't last forever. Do you know like when you um get to the point in the game where you have like you have to get the key from the um mayor? Piper is there. So if she doesn't show up there, then Something I wrong. can't contain her whatsoever. The Rage are too late. Office is closed. I know you must be busy, but I won't take much of your time, miss. It's important. You don't get it. The detective, he's gone. Missing. Picture on milk carton time? If only it was that simple, right? <laughs> Nick disappeared working a case. Skinny Malone's gang had kidnapped a young woman and he tracked them down to their hideout in Park Street Station. There's an old vault down there they use as a base. I told Nick he was walking into a trap, but he just smiled and walked out the door like he always does. Who's this skinny Malone character? Yeah, it's not like he's straight out of a comic book. Good neighbor, and that means he's in the well-pressed suits and machine gun school of thuggery. So like Al Capone, good to know. You said Malone's from Good Neighbor? Yeah, it's a tough neighborhood. Northeast a ways. People with power there care about two things. Style and body count. I'll find him. You have my word. Thank you. Nick should be easy to spot. He's always wearing that old hat and trench coat getup. Please hurry. Got it. And yeah, we have a perk. Okay. Like when you know where you have to go in Diamond City. Newcomer, huh? Oh great, a nuclear one. -er. If the weather couldn't get any more worse. Oh, we have Story of the Century. So, is she gonna be in here or no? No, she's not here. I have to wait till I get. Yeah, I basically have to wait. Hey, are your robot work fresh out of crumpets? Hell, your robot were fresh out of crumpets. Funny. For a second there, I didn't think he was British.
yeah, so we need to make our way over to Yeah, so we have to go find Nick. Basically near Swan's Pond and Combat Zone. We'll find the Park Street Station. Once we get that done, we get back here. We talk with Nick, get the information on our wife's killer. At that point, we basically continue the story from there. Why are you all so panicked? Where the hell did everyone go? Should be people here, yet there aren't any more. How does a massive group of people just vanish? No, there's some still around. Just some. Not much, but it's some. Just that there's always some enemies. Legendary. That was easy. Nothing I need because of course I don't need the good stuff. And of course it's something that I don't bother using Raider armor. I remember when it was the days of just getting lucky. But then you just don't even bother using it. But it's basically like Raider Arm or something and you're not good about bother using it. Either that or it's too weak. This is the Boston Public Library. Okay, I'll, I'll come back here later. Yeah, Boston Public Library. Okay. Because I'm going to have to come back here as a part of a quest for Good Neighbor. So I think... Yeah, so let's head up to the... Hello, Brahmin. 
Oh, and you don't even have anything in your pack. Yeah, we're not over to the Malboro house. Because that can be used as a base. If you so choose to use it. Here it is. And there's no power armor station. You tell shall rest in the grave together. So, yeah. I do know that this house was actually made by uh, Eleonora, the one that makes most house mods for Fallen Skyrim. So, we're in good hands. As I said, good hands. Alright, I didn't even get the, um... Because I, I have a new bottle, like, uh, bobblehead system. So they're basically in different locations than they would be normally. Yeah, and I can't even pick up any of this stuff, so. Yeah, I'm just gonna keep that going. Like, this stuff's very detailed. Like, I think you can use that? No. Like, I don't even know if it's usable. Because I don't have HUD on. There's keys. I'll take all that. Lots of explosives, weapons locker, all the weapons that I could possibly make, <laughs> and more. Like, this is the stuff that you dream of making, but it looks horrible when you bother making it. And it just keeps you away from building forever because of it. No, I need to get rid of Ghoul Slayer on this. Let's do effect. Get rid of that. Get rid of that as I don't need that. Yeah, so I can basically put Ghoul Slayer on the ring. Let's put it on the red leather. Yeah, because some of them are only available in the first part. Yeah, and this is probably different stuff. First aid and first aid. If only the generator wasn't so noisy, this would actually be very good. Why does this guy look like Aquaman? Like, he looks strangely like Aquaman. Put locker, a locker. And we're moving on because I'm probably not going to use this house. <laughs> this is just like a base if I need it. Well, 
I'm pretty sure I didn't even explore the whole house, but still. Not that I'm going to use, as I prefer the... Actually, I'll just want to show you when I actually purchase it. Because it makes sense then just, like, you get to the house, you own it. You actually have to buy the one that I'm going to get. Master, thank you. Okay. Now we need to get over to the location. Park Street Station, Deep Pacific. Get some, motherfucker. What the? Oh, crap. You got to good me. I think. Yeah, I need to go around. Can't open it from this end. And this end's also changed. Is there any side of this that is not chained? No, I don't want to use this one. That ain't no disappearing act. That's when I blow your face open with goddamn bullets. It's simple enough to do. Cotsworth, when did we not get anything good? It's Fallout. They just give me shit for no fucking reason. There's another one up there. I can do this all day. I see you. Oh, for the... There. I need to increase my stealth. What? Can you give me a moment? I need health. And badly because I just got blown to shit. Right, my legs are screwed. And both of them. This fight's done and over with. 
even though the music is still going for some reason. You gotta reload sometime, asshole. Oh, where the hell are you? Where the hell are you, Fruxix? <laughs> Okay, you come out from the bottom. And he came out from here, okay. So maybe that's where this person is? I have no idea. But seriously, where the fuck is that other person? Teamwork. I hear you. I will be back.
I'm back. Let's get onto where the hell is it gonna go? Right, find Nick. But first, we can use this. We can make some Psycho. And then use that to make Psycho Jet. And... Yeah, let's get the rat away. To make a refreshing beverage. That'll be nice. Yeah, I'm not going to be using things like bear traps because you can carry a lot of these and they each weigh 8, but they do so little damage. I might just get, get I might just get chemist and that's it. Because chemist is one of the things I'm going to probably be using a fair bit because then I can increase the length of drugs. No, let me get the other stuff. Before you decide to lock me in here. It makes sense why these were very bad. And not a good idea. You try surviving 200 years at least. Or maybe like, how long did it take until like civilization in the first Fallout game started coming out? Maybe like 80 something years? Maybe a hundred? Like, you try waiting that long in something that small Oh, we're at one spawn. Okay. We're basically here. But am I gonna try taking on Swan? Knowing me, I'll play it smart. Yeah, I'm, that's clearly an X. Meaning, big danger, don't go in. <laughs> Because of this fucker. Okay, so let's see. Fragmentation mines. I'm going to lay these like little traps and breadcrumbs. As this is one of the ways that I'm going to sort of try and get a very large amount of damage on him really quickly. But of course, I'm gonna need to be away from the blast radius. So, quick save. And use. Okay, where's the head? Standing room. What's all this then? Come on, Swan. And he blew them up along with Codsworth. Okay, need to take a lot of drugs. And this is why the John Marston is so good. It's OP as hell, but it's so worth it. I don't know how much health this guy even has. I don't know how much I need to 
plug you full of holes. Crap, got a burst for attack. Quantum. I'm probably gonna addict you to this shit. Okay, gotta, I gotta get the fuck away. I gotta break distance. Okay. I shouldn't have showed the minigun ammo. I literally have no idea how much damage I've done to this guy. At all. And my only strategy is... Using jet at this point. Jet and psycho. That is my number one strategy currently. Okay. Yeah, I get a risk for attack. about that. I'm doing terrible. I need to get out of here. I need to get the fuck out of here. Okay, um, considering you decided to go back into your hiding spot, I'm just gonna go back to my quick save. Um, yeah, I'm just gonna have Codsworth wait over in the corner, so, yeah, I'm not having him destroy all my hard work. He needs to be destroyed all my hard work. Then we'll fuck. Yeah, the bottle cut lines are still there. Okay. So, Consworth, I need you to come. Decision, general, yeah, danger. No shit. Uh, hey. Wait yeah. there. Some of the swan boats are still intact. Uh. I need him to stay here. Because I know the first thing he does is shoot off a rock. It's just a test, but. Oh wait, his legs crippled. His legs crippled. Oh shit, that's actually good. I just have to basically wail on him. Yeah, let's go with this. Dead chat. No kill shot, right? Yeah, I have no idea what kill shot does. I'll call it kill shot.
But I have a lot of health now, so that's good. Hang on, let me just boost that up incredibly quickly with that. How are you so accurate with the rock swan? I know it's unhealthy. Yeah. And this is why you use things that you can use with the ground. It's a lot easier. And now I can attach Furious to anything else I so choose. For sandwich effort, each consecutive is the same target. So basically, I can take. Yeah, I have heavy leather and the sturdy right arm. So I can basically take what I so wish off of weapons and then put on something else. So basically, if I want a furious minigun, I could do that. Right now, I'm going to just switch these. It won't exactly look right because it doesn't mesh with the legs because it's not the same color but at least it's something hey I'm come on here. okay i'm gonna need you You duck. I want a different companion and fast because I I really don't like Codsworth honestly like I know it's a sin for me to say that probably but I don't like him in particular like I like his personality and all that but having this him to just say sir each and every time it gets annoying and even though it's not like oh it's actual conversation it's literally anything like sir Nick and anything good that concludes this round Kate is the undisputed Winner! And who's this? Come on down where we can see ya. I think he's shy. Come on, I don't fight. Well... What the shit? He ain't shit, supposed shit. to be in here. <laughs> Rip him to shreds! Hmm? You're mine now. <laughs> Let's turn the light.
Yeah, you're just gonna get burned alive by Kaltorth if you try anything, so. I wouldn't bother getting close. Please just give me some sort of challenge. I don't want this to be easy. But no, it's always easy. What the hell are you running for? Get the hell back here. Lost them. You, feel that? you ain't running. <laughs> you ain't running from shit. <laughs> I just smack you with my goddamn shotgun. You think they're done out there? We don't want any trouble. Not anymore, at least. Oh, just peek your head up, you damn cowards. The heck with that. I'm too pretty to go out like this. Is it over? Well, that could have gone worse. <laughs> I don't know. It seemed quite the performance from where I was standing. Are you fucking high or something? Why am I asking? Of course you are. Still won the fight, didn't I? You're strung out and getting sloppy, is what you are. Of course, I suppose you ain't got to worry about that now. Seems this one just put us out of business. Out of business. I'm not sure if I should kiss you or have my little bird here feed you your own entrails. I told you to quit calling me that. If your bird is going to feed you, feed you my own entrails to me, you better to face a bullet. I saved your lives. You should be grateful. Grateful? For killing our meal ticket. Meal Excuse ticket. me if I don't rush to embrace our savior. They weren't the friendliest bunch, but keeping those idiots entertained, at least um, kept the lights on. To hell with them. More will come. Just need a quick breather and I'll be ready to go. I will give breather. you a top three. What? So you can slam more of that junk into your Probably at number now. one, you know it's what? either... I think this was a blessing like probably, probably Curie you at number one. Bout. What'd you think of Kate's work? Then two would be... I would say Nick and then McCready. Not sure. I didn't catch the whole thing. Yeah, I guess you were pretty busy cleaning house. Yeah. Impressive. Blowing brains. Good old style of man. Think you're good enough to do me a favor. So here's my predicament. I suddenly got no audience. No audience means I got no caps coming in. And if you ain't bringing in caps, little bird, you ain't an asset. You're a liability to me and to yourself. So, here's what I'm thinking. What say I let you take over her contract? She goes with you, watches your back. Look, you'd be doing me a favor while I try to get the place back in order. What do you say? Me? And him? I like to hear Kate's I'd thoughts like to know this. what Kate thinks. Don't I get a say so this is a contract. That ain't how a contract works. Besides, you really want to stay here? 
No audience, no caps, no one to talk to, but yours truly. Jesus. Point taken. Okay, at least she gets his so, she's on board. <laughs> now what about you? Eh, sure went out. Sure. I could use someone watching my back. Good. It's settled then. And here, take this. It's the purse from the last fight. Exterminator's fee. Now just wait a second. What exactly are you gonna do without me here? You don't need to worry about me. I'll get this place set up right. Maybe find a less blood-soaked clientele. Now get the hell out of here. You ain't welcome anymore, little bird. You're a real son of a bitch. You know that, Tommy? You don't have to tell me. I guess you just come find me then when you want to head out. Kate. So, you're ready to head out? Let's. Ready. About time I got out of this place. Let's go. Ah, Miss Kate. So good of you to agree to take my place. May fortune favor the brave, my dear. You're beginning to get me nerves, Codsey. Oh, trust me, he's already got on mine. Curie, no, not not Curie, Kate. We're gonna go and get Nick. Good old Nicky. <sighs> Game, can you load a little quicker? Did you load any slower? I'll take it as a yes that you can. But you don't give a shit about speeding it up. Is that right? Never mind. When I'm bitching and complaining, I actually work harder. Note this self in the future. Oh yeah, and the Freedom Trail. I need to do this. But I'm not gonna do it today. Cause I'm just here to make story progress. And if I can get a few things along the way, even better. Am I probably the like, I'm probably one of the few that actually give their companions better weapons. Like, I know there's, like, a whole mod on PSN that you can just I'm telling download. You, joining Skinny Malone's crew was the best decision we've ever made. Look at this place. I still say my Malone's weak. We caught that detective snooping around, and what does he do? Locks him up. Like, he ain't got the balls to just kill him. Well, don't let his new girl hear that. She'll start swinging that bat of hers at your face until there ain't no face left. Whoa. You hear that? Oh, for the love of... I hate the sugarman. Okay, get up. Much better. Come on, baby. Show me what you've got. If I can just shoot you, fucker. Molly's always got, I got two of them. Yeah, using any melee weapons against a, like a semi-auto weapon is not a good idea. So the big gym is just going to have to set out for this round. That's it. 
Probably gonna have to take some shit at some point. Either that or some psycho jet. And I don't think Not I have tight. This. Nope. Not yet anyway. Probably gonna get that later, around the fifteen or something. Okay. So let's get the stuff that I can off of you. And of course you have a 10 millimeter. You know what, Curry? I mean, why do I keep hey. calling you Curry? Be worth You're it. Kate. You're the goddamn psyker from the combat zone. Well, it's close enough to being called a raider. Besides Gage. Okay. Now that she has limos, I can take about anything I want, weapon-wise. Except for... Well, any automatic. Like a semi-auto. Like, like, the scarce ammo stuff that they have. It just puts one bullet or something on the enemy. It makes it so I have to actually bother using melee. Which is interesting, because I barely use melee, usually. What was that? What the hell? All right, very funny. Get back to work. What the? Hmm. Of course. And I throw a grenade and... Of course. How long have I been streaming? Alright, I can just... I don't have to do uptime anymore because I can just go through the dashboard. I'm telling you, joining Skinny Malone's crew was the best decision we've ever made. Look at this place. I still say Malone's weak. We caught that detective snooping around, and what does he do? Locks him up. Like he ain't got the balls to just kill him. Okay, let's go over to this a different way. The fast way. to get to Fastville. Of course, I need to pass some stuff off to you, Kate. Hey. What's yours is mine. Right, darling? Of course. My junk is yours, but nothing else. And you call me a friend later, which is just sad because I share my junk with you.
I'm not gonna break another lock on this. There. That's it. Fashion joke and making things real easy. One crank. Right through the bullseye. the next part of Idiot's Savant is that way I get five times the amount but that's all I'm going to invest in Idiot's Savant is the next part is basically useless because they don't stack with the other part of it I like how they have like the names of people on them. Like it makes it seem like it was actually owned by someone before the war. Hey.
It's always better to get the... Like, this is kind of like meh for a weapon. It's not good. Like, it's something that you can use, but it won't hold up for long. again like I've I've had that activate when a quest happens and you get basically so much that you'll have no idea what to do with I think I might have leveled up twice just for a minute yeah it just give me the square crispy square bits and that'll be fine I thought you were the fun one the fucking trigger McKay. <laughs> so I got a question. Why the hell would anyone build a vault out of a subway station? This place is like the opposite of airtight. Because they weren't planning to use it, you moron. We used to pull this kind of con all the time back before the war. Get a bunch of union boys to work some construction job that would go nowhere. Keep everyone on payroll. I don't! Oh no, you don't! <coughs> Let's go. Give me juiced up. Ah, my leg! Your leg, yet I hit you in the head. This weapon could be better. Shy's behind it. like the vault was never completed. Yo, psst. What is it? Over there. No problem. I will send you in, Kate. Hmm. Gotcha. Kate, fight for fuck's sake instead of going where I need you. Get your arm, my body double over fuck's sake. I need you to at least fight. What the? <laughs> and there he goes again. Shit, where'd that come from? Getting rained on over here. 
Okay, so. We being followed. Yes, we being failed. Good old water. And at least now we don't have to worry about being gunned down, I think. For now, at least. I know I have to worry about it later, but... Yeah, that's in a few minutes. We can breathe. Like, when I get out of this vault and basically see the sun with Nick... If it even is some, if, if it even is the morning. But it's right now for me, it's one in the goddamn morning and I'm tired as hell. So I'm basically running on fumes, so. Skinny Malone more time to think about how he's gonna bump you off. Don't give me that crap, Valentine. You know nothing, you got nothing. Really? I saw him writing your name down in that black book of his. Lousy cheating card shark, I think. Then he struck the name across three times. There we go. Sweet. Hey, you! Any lock for that matter. I don't know who you are, but Getting we got three minutes. Getting into places I not wanted is a talent I've acquired over the years. Coming back. Get this door open. Now I'm going to hack this. So busy. Through. There we go. I'm busy. And my number is 998, nine, for God's sake. Yeah, this vault was, um, like for all the rich folk. But they were put into basically. Ah, uh -huh, my knight in shining armor. Question is. Places where they. All this that would be the exact opposite of rich and luxurious. Just to see how they would cope. And they were complaining after complaining. But they never fixed it, so. I need you to find someone, but it's complicated. I don't exactly know where they could be or how long they've been gone. Well, I've done jobs with less. Somehow nice and simple never makes it onto the menu in my world. I've been cooped up in here for weeks. Turns out the runaway daughter I came here to find wasn't kidnapped. She's Skinny Malone's new flame. And she's got a mean streak. Anyway, you got troubles, and I'm glad to help. But now ain't the time. Let's blow this joint. They got the hell we'll out of here. You know, we can literally just go out the way we came in instead of having to go all the way around. Time. 
muscled out of the old neighborhood by bigger players until they found this place. Don't know what happened to the previous owners, but they're not exactly around to charge rent. Empty vault. Perfect. Gold don't watch that bad. At least it gets an assist from that. Hold on, I hear some of them coming. There they are. How do you want to play this? His only job is to check on the prison. Why does that take so fucking long, huh? Hey, Dino, quit razzing that detective and get down here. Where the heck is he? Whoa. You hear that? Just one Molotov and they're all dead. That was impressively easy. Never mind, they're not all dead. Now they're all dead. Take all my shit. The floors. Look at this, you're gonna be carrying a lot of stuff. Especially in this place. Later on there is so much stuff I'm gonna need here to carry. You know, this is basically like their locker rooms. Imagine a rich person using this. Like, you wouldn't see them doing this. Like, at all. There we are. Hell of a lot easier to do when the lock isn't on the other side. Hey. Oh, sure. Make me carry more of your junk. Isn't that about what I always make you do? You should be used to this by now. Hell, isn't that what all players do? Not the blood pumping, it's the coolant. It's always been the coolant. Every second you hide, every second you hide. Good. Yeah, in there, Kate. There we go. And again, plus five action points. The man who could stomp time. And this is novice lock. No one should be drawn. There we go. Nice. Okay.
Now I'm going to take all this and then give it all to Kate. The important stuff at least. Because at least this stuff is clean. Because they'd be like in this vault, the rich would be eating like salad of Salisbury steaks. Mashed potatoes. Heads up. Like yeah. you would not see them eating that. Aww. And here I thought you wanted to snuggle. You can snuggle with my junk if that's something you like. But I will leave that up to your discretion. As well as your choice and Horses. the loss of your dignity. Can't pick that. Okay. Your sorrows honor, away. That's just garbage. I toss it. Have a minute. Oh yes, I gotta make it. Point out what you need. I'd really like to talk to you. You ready now? Yeah, I'm. I'm, I'm good. Is something wrong? I don't know. You tell me. After Tommy stuck me with you, I was expecting to hate your guts. Not only because you <sighs> agreed to pick up me contract, but because I was waiting for you to order me around like hired help. Now so far, you've been treating me like a friend. Hell, you've been damn near nice to me. This is now, probably going to be one of the fastest grateful. ones that we're going to do. Your kindness is starting to make me wonder if there's anything I learned in the combat zone. It was that nobody does things for other people without expecting something in return. Exactly. Time to pay up. Yeah, cute. pay up. Real cute. I spent three years living at the combat zone. Smelled like puke and piss. But I called it home. I was making a few caps. Had me own bed to sleep in and three hot meals a day. Then the raiders took over the place. You know that lot. You aren't exactly what you'd call the gentle type. After they moved in, if you didn't keep looking over your shoulder, you were liable to get sucker punched or robbed. Or worse. Didn't take me long to learn that I had to put my hard-earned caps to good use. Buying friends was essential to making life easy. So, I guess I'm waiting for you to hand me a bill. You know what I mean? What? You mean the check? The check of friendship. Why are you so paranoid about debts? I really yeah. don't want to talk about it. I'll tell you what. Give me some time and I'll think of something I can do to repay you. I'm not a rich girl, but I'm sure we can agree on something. After all, what are friends for? Skinny Malone and the rest of his boys are waiting for us somewhere. The name's, uh... Ironic, but don't let that fool you. It's dangerous. Another lock go for it. Be too hard. Okay, just gonna take some. Just take some whiskey and you'll be fine. Okay, I got it. But just I make sure to eat the whiskey rose. Right. Once we step through this door, get ready for anything. Go on, Nick. You go first, I'll wait. Nick 
Mickey, what are you doing? You come into my house, shoot up my guys? You have any idea how much this is gonna set me back? I wouldn't be here if it weren't for your two-timing game, Skinny. You ought to tell her to write home more often. Oh, poor little Valentine. Ashamed you got beat up by a girl. I'll just run back home to Daddy, shall I? Should've left that alone, Nikki. This ain't the old neighborhood. In this vault, I'm king of the castle, you hear me? And I ain't letting some private dick shut us down now that I finally got a good thing going. I told you we should have just killed him! But then you had to get all sentimental. All that stupid crap about the old times. Dala, I'm handling this! Skinny Malone's always got things under control. Always? Oh, yeah? Then what's this guy doing here, huh? Valentine must have brought him here to rub us all out. Okay. Even if I fail the encourage violence part, it won't affect Nick. Hey, but I'll get a boost to, to Kate. Skinny's no good for you, Darla. You put a bullet in him. And I just might let you go. What kind of girl do you think I am? Kill him, Skinny! <laughs> Let's end this. Let's end this the good old fashioned way. By getting addicted to Jet or Psycho. Um, he's lost his head. So yeah, I think he's a bit lighter. Let's see what dress. Exactly where that surface ladder is, luckily enough. Uh, what time is it in game I'm in? 2 a.m. So it's going to be basically dark as all hell. And we'll only be able to see his eyes. Charisma is your ability to convince your companions to sleep with you. <laughs> I can't deny that. Because depending on if they're romanceable, yes. You, you can fuck them. Look alive. But you have time to talk now. Still yeah, for a second time. Important to say. Is it important? Yeah, I'd say it is. Got a lot to do with our little partnership. What do you think? Go on. I'm not sure how to put this. We've been on the road together for a while. And we've taken some hard knocks. But through all that crap, I notice you've always been sticking by me. You know, watching me back and making sure I don't do anything stupid. 
I think maybe it's time to tell you a little bit about who you're traveling with. There's no reason for us to keep acting like we're strangers. Didn't we already go through this? Yeah, you don't know me. You don't know me a thing. It all starts with two ways of humanity, I suppose you could call me parents. I'm convinced I was a mistake, because I can't remember a single moment that they treated me like their daughter. I was yelled at and beaten. Everything I did was wrong. Nothing but a nuisance in their eyes. The whole time I was telling myself that they had to love me, even if it was just the tiniest bit, because they never kicked me out. Then me 18th birthday arrived, and I found out why they kept me around. They slapped a shock collar around me neck and sold me to slavers. They didn't even care enough about me to say goodbye. 18 years of suffering through that shite, and all I was worth to them was a pocket full of caps. My god. I'm so sorry. Thanks. But there is more to the story. It would be easy to blame me charm and personality on me parents. But they didn't make me this way. I did. I was with those slavers for five years. Roughest five of me goddamn life. The things they made me do. The way they used me for their amusement. It sickens me to me stomach even thinking about it. But I buy the slavers with the fuck you expect their own methods against them. Stealing a few caps out of a sleeping man's pocket is a piece of cake. As long as you don't get greedy. I don't know how you survived. That makes two of us. It took every ounce of patience I had. But after five years, I had finally pocketed enough to buy me own way out of there. But instead of heading off to try and repair the shambles of me life, I gave in to me rage and I headed home. You can imagine the look on me parents' faces when I kicked open their door. What you can't imagine is what they looked like after. After I emptied me gun into them. You did what you had to do. Did I? When I close me eyes, I'm not gonna question it. All I can see is their faces twisted with fear. And then my mind starts wandering and I start judging myself. And it's ripping me the fuck apart. You think I inject myself with all that shite and drink myself drunk because I'm a tough Irish girl. I do it so I can forget and move on with my miserable life. So there you are. The entire flawed package known as Kate. Stripped bare for your perusal. I'm proud of you. I knew I was taking a chance telling you all this. But I never expected you to say you were proud of me. I... I, I think yourself. I needed to hear that from you. In a world like this. <laughs> Thank you. You take you take just into your hands. It's fine. Good. I wouldn't want to strain our little partnership. Well, thanks for listening to me prattle. I suppose we can get back to business now. So yeah. Talk with Nikki. Hey, now. Valentine. Are you ready to talk? How do you know to find me down in that old vault? Your secretary, Ellie. She sent me. She did? I should give her a raise. Now, you mentioned something about a missing person. No trace of where they've gone. I want you to come to my office in Diamond City. Give me all the details. Besides, I think you've earned a chance to sit down and clear your head. I'll meet you there. See you in Diamond City. <laughs> Yes! Oh fuck! How many times did I level up? I leveled up once. Fuck yes. Oh, this was one of the times where it gets to the point of. There we go. Like, it gets to the point where. You're hyped beyond belief just to hear that sound and have known that you just completed the quest. Yeah, there's the sound effect. And then they got all the way to that. Which probably got yeah, like 15 something. Like 1,500 at least. So I'm just gonna head back to Diamond City. And. Then we're gonna end. Oh, right, I'm, I'm over encumbered.
Volca. So basically I'm probably going to save after this loads and then I'm just going to end it. So probably going to end the stream but like now-ish. Looking for some action. I'm betting we'll find it here. Look alive. Hi. Sure, sure. Just keep your shirt on. You wanted to ask something. Okay, so yeah. How do you think things are between us? Things are going great and they keep getting better. I hope it lasts. Because right now we're at the 500 point, point for me. Kate. At the 750, we're gonna basically get a quest to help her. I'm not gonna say for what, but it doesn't make sense when we get to it. So yeah, this is basically when I'm, where I'm gonna end it. Save. And end the stream.